Greetings friends, that gaming author here, and I'm very pleased to introduce a new Let's Play that I've been wanting to do for so long, and oh my gosh, I'm so excited to play this game, by the way. I've been waiting for the English translation of this game for so long, and oh, I'm just so excited to finally get to do a Let's Play for it. And yeah, all characters here in a fictional and your resemblance to real persons living or dead is entirely coincidental. Pretty average uh, intro there, and you guys will... Sh soon see what game we're playing, and I've been wanting to play this game for so long, and I'm so excited to finally get to play it. This will be entirely blind. I've never touched this game before. Ordinary daily life. Each day, always the same. Our youth, slipping away. What if all that was taken away? What if our school was drawn into another world? This is the story of young men and women lost in the abyss. Oh god, I'm so excited. You guys seriously wouldn't believe how long I've been wanting to play this game, and I'm gonna totally play it blind here on YouTube for you guys, because oh, this is gonna be an experience, I can tell. Shin Megami Tensei If Aeon Genesis just recently came out with this English translation, and thank god. I'm so sorry Aeon Genesis for all the crap you went through when making this translation. Get a good rest, because I can imagine you are very busy with this. And uh, thank you so much for presenting this for us and allowing us to play this, because oh, I'm so ready, man. Alright, let's jump right on in. Has the Shin Megami Tensei 2 interface, it looks like. Yahweh. I am a virtual fortune teller. Welcome to my virtual world. So, you wish me to do a reading? Very well. Please tell me your agenda. Oh, cool! It's one of these games! Okay, you know what? There aren't enough female protagonists. Let's go with this character. Please tell me your name. We're going to go with the... Hmm. I'll go with the female protagonist of a book I'm currently writing. Whoops. Malor. <laughs> so let me go ahead and just fill it with one M then. There we go. Your name is Mallory, correct? Yes. Then please answer my questions. It's like the intro to a Pokemon game. <laughs> Do you like video games? I love games, they're okay. I hate games, I don't play games. Pfft. Club you in. Go home. <laughs> I'm in neither of these. Well, I mean, Culture Club is related to like the arts, right? I'll go with that. Usually I tend to forget to do it. I never do it. I don't know. Uh, I tend to forget to do it. <laughs> I've forgotten the question. Oh, I love this already. Oh, whatever, I'll just go with often. What's my favorite subject? Out of all of these, probably grammar, because I'm an author, and that's kind of like my natural element. And your favorite sport? Nah, I'm not into sports. Do you own a smartphone? Interesting. Yes, I'm always using it. Playing indoors, uh, reading quietly is probably the most accurate. I don't know how to count. Uh, two or three people. Found a wallet. It's like a job interview, what the hell, dude? 10,000 yen. Uh, let's see, it's with the cash with friends, toss the money, keep wallet. <laughs> yes, oh, I love this. You know what, I'm just gonna go with the morally correct one here. Your strong point is your exceptional speed. I am hella slow, Nova. And I do not mean your physical speed, but the quickness of your wit. Okay, that makes more sense. <laughs> you should always make snap decisions, looking ahead and acting quickly. God damn, it's like one of those freaking personality tests. However, there are times when you will need to think things through thoroughly before making a decision. I know that struggle. 
Be careful. Will do. Oh, that was interesting. And this is totally the Shin Megami Tensei 2 UI. I love it. Oh, damn, that's the Chaos theme from Shin Megami Tensei 1. Is this white ass? Whatever. Welcome to my world. Until yesterday, I was just a human. A shining example of an indi exceptional individual. Yes, I'm human, but I... I am not gonna read this because it's an automatic scrolling text. A demon emperor? Oh, shit. Imagine the quest if I get fortune. What? This dude's crazy. He's got his evil laugh, of course. Accompanied by the chaos theme. My goodness. What the hell is that all about? Hey, how long are you gonna sleep? Mallory? Mallory, school's already over. Oh, we fell asleep at school? Wow, you really slept well. I don't know if it's because of all the weird, scary dreams I've been having, but I haven't been able to sleep at all lately. I love that all this music is from, like, Shin Megami Tensei 1 and 2. It's so good. I envy you. Anyway, I'm going home. Bye! Alright, see you later. After school classroom, there are a few students left here. This is totally where they got the inspiration for Persona, and I love it. That sounds oddly realistic to be coming from a Super Nintendo sound chip. Uh... What the hell? Uh... Hurry, run! Oh, what? what? What happened? Something weird as hell is going on outside. It's not night, but it's pitch black. And it, this is the plot of Persona 1. <laughs> what should we do? Classroom 2D is in a panic. This song is so fucking good. Mallory, there you are. Your classmate. You mean Shirakawa suddenly talked to you. I've been looking for you. I need to talk to you, Mallory. Listen, all of us are trapped here in the school. Something strange is going on outside, and this is the entire school is warped into another dimension. I have a bad feeling about this. I don't think we're gonna get out of this okay. Oh well, thanks for the optimism. No, there's no time for this. If we don't do something, we're all gonna die. At least that's this gut feeling I get. Please give me a hand. Let's save the school and everyone in it. Well, this is a little sudden, but okay. Mallory, come with me. Uh, sure, let's go with you, me. I do know that instead of alignments in this game, the story changes depending on who you choose as your partner, so I just kind of want to start off with Yumi, and if I decide that, like, we can branch out from the story, I'll do more episodes with the other partners and stuff, and, like, as a male gender, too, and just see if that changes the story as well. Thanks, let's go, if we don't hurry. Okay, cool. We've got, we both have hella low HP, though. Ooh, SMT1 Remix, I like it! Oh, it's so good! It sounds way better in this game. Oh, do we not have a map like an SMT1? Oh well. You may not pass. I'm with the school's disciplinary committee. Dude, this is fucking Cypher. You have to do what I say. Well then. Okay. Okay, 2C. Hang on, let's go in here. Just kind of see what's going on. Okay, this is totally reminding me of Persona 1, by the way. Like, I don't know if, you know, if anyone's gonna watch this, if you, any of you have played Persona 1. This, it kind of begins a lot like this. It's weird. Somebody help, we're all trapped in the school. Okay. Yeah, I know it totally begins, like, with the whole crazy shit going on outside. What the hell's going on outside? That dude looked like Sykes from Kingdom Hearts. <laughs> or however you pronounce his name. The dude with the umlaut over the I in his name. Keep it cool, man. Keep it cool. Just calm down and think. 
Man, everyone's freaking out. I am digging these remixes, by the way. I mean, this isn't really so much of a remix as much as it is like a... Just, okay, that, those are the stairs. I kind of want to explore the... Okay, that goes down. Okay, so that's just another exit. So, let's go up then. Just kind of figure out what's going on. Can we climb the stairs? See, so, yeah, sure thing. Uh, man, I made a bomb cup of coffee this morning. Or, not this morning, this is like the afternoon right now. Okay, what? Like, I assumed that was gonna be the exit or something, but I guess not. Alright. Cool. This guy's fishy. Check out that crazy look in his eyes. Huh. Okay. 2E. This is totally reminding me a lot of Persona, and I love it. Looks like someone had some sort of a cult ceremony in the gym. Wonder who it was. Okay, so... Quick note about this game before I kind of move on to 2F. Uh, for those who don't know, this is a bit of trivia. The Shin Megami Tensei series was inspired by a sci-fi novel in Japan uh, called Megami Tensei Digital Devil Story, I believe it was called. And it's basically about a high school kid who uses, like, some crazy psycho supercomputer to summon demons and destroy everything. He goes batshit crazy. And I'm noticing a lot of similarities in this game, or between this game and the actual book, so I kind of wonder if, like, this game was uh, inspired by the book, and then therefore Persona was inspired by this. I mean, they're made by the same creators and all, but you know what I mean. I saw Hazama in the hallway. He was glowing like a ghost or something. Isn't Hazama, like, a character from the book? I don't know. I, it's been a long time since I actually read the book, because uh, I have an English translation on my computer, but I don't know. I feel like I've seen that name before. Alright, let's move on to 2G. I'm just kind of investigating here now. That Otsuki, you know, the science teacher, totally creeps me out. Dude stays holed up in his little lab all day long doing, well, I don't know what, but something. Something's messed up when a guy like that ends up in charge of the disciplinary committee. Ah, uh, there's some shady crap going on in the school. Alright, let's see what's in here. 2H. Yo, new song. Oh, Mallory. Good to see you keeping your wits about you in a time like this. I, on the other hand, have no idea what to do. And I just bought a brand new laptop with my bonus. Why am I worrying about that at a time like this? Uh, guess I'm not much of a teacher. I'm just paralyzed and can't do anything. What should I do? Man, like, yeah, is it like most of the soundtrack is like consists of remixes from uh, SMT 1 and 2, and I love it. Is this just an empty room? Okay, cool. Can't have first person dungeon crawler. Bleh, bleh. First person dungeon crawlers without uh, freaking dead ends and shit. Alright, those go down, which would leave us to the floor we were at before. So let's go up again. Oh, damn. You stand in front of a dimensional rift and cannot proceed. Spooky, dude. Alright, so. We can't go up, so let's go back down to the last floor. Hey, hey, hey. I'm digging this game though. It's like it's got a really nice feel. Let's go down one more. Oh, store. I mean, we don't have any money, as far as I can tell. Yeah, we don't have money. Oh, default currency in this game is Maka. Cool. Who's there? It's just you, Mallory. It's me. Ariwichi. Okay, I just I needed to make sure I didn't butcher that name. Is this a friend of yours? Yeah, it's Mallory from 2D. Akiko's here with me. There's some monster in the gym, so the two of us are hiding out here. Ryuichi, I'm scared. Don't worry, I won't let anything happen to you. Will you search the storeroom? Might as well. Mallory's group got ice pick. Cool. Okay, so is that like a weapon we can use? Hang on, let me see. Uh, Alright, let's view Mallory's status. 
Man, the AI in this game is awesome. Or not the AI, the UI is what I mean. That's what I meant. Okay. So let's check item, equip. Oh nice, it does boost our attack from 0 to 21. Damn. That's a good weapon. Janitor. I love this song. I, it's Dude from Shimming on Tensei 2! Awesome! Well, I mean, it looks like it. Like, I think it's a palette swap. I thought I'd clean up the entryway. When I went outside, the sky suddenly got really dark. Got freaked out and came back inside. Yeah, that's totally the freaking. I can't remember his name, but he's the guy who keeps you in Shin Megami Tensei 2. Hang on, wait, what's on the entrance? Uh, it's a dimensional rift. Damn. So we're basically stuck in the school then. So that's where we... Uh, oh, damn. I feel like we should probably search around a little more before moving to the gym. So, uh, I will cut this out if I don't make any further progress. Just to... Uh, Kind of be on the safe side. Ooh, music. Okay, let's check this room out. Hmm? I see you're with Shirakawa. Shirakawa, I'm surprised to see you trying to save the school, but you're just wasting your time. <laughs> just stay in the classroom and don't ruffle yourself, princess. <laughs> uh, we got some arguing going on. This is totally like reminding of, reminding me of Persona 1. I love it. Pascal's theme! Yes! It's my jam. What homeroom are you from? You shouldn't enter the principal's office uninvited. Well, that was short-lived. <laughs> the remixes in this game sound amazing. Like, these are way more high quality than the original versions of the songs. Ah, Mallory from 2D. I'd ask what you need in the infirmary, but it's not the time for that. I have no clue what's going on out there. Do you know anything? If you're not feeling well, I'll heal what ails you. Sweet. Please be careful. Don't do anything dangerous. I'm worried about you, so take this. Ointment. Nice. I want everyone in the school to be safe, so please take care. Okay, sweet. And then what's in here? Damn, there's no dial tone. Can't contact anyone. You want something? Sorry, but this just isn't the time for it. Well, oh, nice! Okay, cool. So I will totally save. Okay, cool. Even though we've made no progress. Yes, we will. Okay, well, nice to know that guy's there, so... Let's remember that location. It's on the first floor to the uh, left of the medical room. Okay, cool. Let's see, and those are the stairs, and then club room. Let's see what's up here. Baseball. A couple of students left the school trying to get home, but not a single one has returned. The whole school has become... <laughs> the whole school has kind of become like the first village of an RPG, you know? Oh, I love it. Two helmets. And a metal bat, hell yeah. Playing Earthbound now, buddy. Alright, so let's go ahead and, uh, see, I knew I was right to freaking, like, check the equipment. Alright, defense 16 and... Okay, yeah, that metal bat is gonna go to the uh, Yumi. So let's go for the helmet and the metal bat. There we go. Yes, I knew I was right to freaking check the rooms. Football. So did you hear? There are monsters in the gym. Wonder if that has anything to do with that creepy ass ceremonial get up in there. You want to have up it? That's a. For those who don't know, that's a reference to the Megami Tensei novel. <laughs> Anyhow, people have been coming in here picking up anything that could work as a weapon. Ain't much left in that department. We search through, of course. Two shoulder pads. All right, cool. So, that's more equipment. So let's see, shoulder pads, alright, awesome, it goes on the body. Doing anything we can to boost defense because this is a Shin Megami Tensei game, so you know I'm gonna get my ass kicked. Alright, let's see, what's over here? Sumo, but I totally skipped a room. Hockey. 
Azama's a creep. You know how they say there's a fine line between genius and insanity? Dude's way beyond that. Yeah, this is totally the plot of a Megami Tensei novel. He's up to something, using demons and black magic and all that garbage. Alright. Two backpads, alright, cool. And then, that leaves the sumo room, which is over here, but first let's check our equipment. Alright, sweet. So, one more for her. Awesome. Okay, I'm so glad I was- I made the decision to actually search this place. Oh great, today was such a wonderful day to decide to dry my mawashi belt outside. wonder what happened to it. It's two rollerblades. It's kind of a random place, like, unless this was some sort of cultural reference I'm not getting. But, either way, we got more equipment, so that's awesome. Alright. Sweet, I think we might be ready. I may save one more time before, uh, deciding to go to the gym. So, let's... Oh, damn. Uh, help! Help! Monsters! Monsters in the school! Oh god, they're gonna kill us all! Oh, shit! It's Gaki! I don't know if we can talk, so let's fight for now. Yeah! Remix of the SMT2 battle theme, man! Oh, two damage. Oh, well, I mean, with how low our HP is, that's probably not a good thing. Oh god, I love this song so much. If 48 Maka, 8 match site, and 32? Yeah, hell yeah. Alright, cool. So... I don't know if she can... I'll boost her speed for now. Alright, and then Yumi, you actually have MP, so let's increase your magic first. Thanks, you really pulled my butt out of the fire. You're Mallory from 2D, right? I'm Sato Kus Bleh, Katsuhiko, head of the computer club. Since we can't get out of the school, I've been trying to get connect to the net to gather whatever information I can. I managed to connect to some weird network and download a really strange application. When I tried to run the program, those monsters, demons, came out. Some guy called Steven uploaded that particular program. It's just a handle, though I doubt. Though, but it's just a handle, though, so I doubt that's his real name. Anyway, I've got the program on disk, but it creeps me out, so you can have it. It's probably safe with you. After all, you can actually kill those things. Of course, it's not going to do you much good without a computer. There are quite a few here, but they're not exactly portable. By the way, I want to save your progress. Hell yeah, dude. I'd say this is pretty good progress for episode 1, actually, because I've been recording for 23 minutes. Can't believe it. Alright, cool. Yeah, we'll continue. I'll save your progress and I'll give you stop by. Going out again, are you? Take care. Make a mistake and you can die out there. Alright, so I will leave it at that because, oh my god, I'm so excited to get into this game. Uh, yes, it's so good. So, next time on this play Shin Megami Tensei If, we will investigate the gym and see what the hell's going on there. So, I will see you guys next time and have a good day.